previously. Oh no, not you. And so we go. Hello friends, my name's Internet, and welcome back to Slay the Spire! Modded! I am going to be playing a character that I have not played in a very, 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 very long time. And I believe was the second mod I've ever played of Slay the Spire. I think the first was the servant, but I could get the, have them out of order. We are going to be playing the clockwork today. Haven't played the clockwork since I started playing Slay the Spire. I was really bad at the clockwork, so we'll see if we're any better today. <laughs> since it's been over a year since I've started playing, just saying. Another try, at least confront the fuzz balls. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do max HP, um, cause I have no idea what I do right now, aside from the moment zone. I think I have an idea of what it does. After you play a card, increase its damage and block for the rest of combat. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, I want to go the direction with the things and the stuff. Kinda wanna go fire blasting. Let's do it. Hello, Frond. Alright. Cannot be played after other cards in a turn and gain one stasis. Uh, permanently increase the damage or block of the cockwork card by one. Um, if I do this, uh, does it take me out of stasis? I guess not. <coughs> Oh, yep, okay. So it's just for that turn. Got it. I forget how great your cards are until you upgrade them. Everything is so gray. Um, none of these are clockwork cards. So. Um. Mm. Would that be clockwork cards? I really don't know. I may be completely crazy. Okay. Uh, let's find out. Uh, huh. I was. Okay. You just keep getting stronger, and I really need you to stop that nonsense, please. Please, just stop doing things. Stop. Okay. Cog Toss. Still six damage, shuffle two cogs into your draw pile. I remember cogs were really good. Cogs are zero cost cards with minor effects that draw you cards. Okay. Snap Keep. Deal five damage. Fetch a card from your discard pile. Adapt a shield. Gain 16 block whenever you play this card. Reduce its cost by one for this combat. Hmm. I like the idea of getting the adaptive shield. Like, it's still better than playing three blocks. So, let's do it. Was I going right or left? I don't remember. I think I was going left. Yeah, I was going left. <coughs> Ooh. I'm curious. The start of each turn, we summon a monster. You've played this turn every two turns. You exhaust. Ba -ba 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 -ba. This does literally nothing for me. So I'm gonna just scroll on back here a little bit. Because there is no reason for me to have that. It doesn't do diddly squat. Thank you. Goodbye. I really should have turned off the duelist mod. I don't know why I didn't. Um, okay. Okay, and boop. And boop. <sighs> All right. Uh, let's do it. It's silly, but I did it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> All right. Uh, striking would be good now. I did it. All right, uh, five block, five block, I'll take it. And 
six trip. <sighs> All right. Um, let's do this, and then I'll hit you with one of these. Lower the cost of that. And then I can hit you with a couple of these again. And this is one, so let's lower it to zero. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is a little more painful, though. Hmm. All right, let's just block this turn. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yeah, actually, thanks. Oh, I should have played a shield. Because, yeah, reasons. Boop. Okay, cool. Gain 12 temporary HP. Hmm. Occam's Razor. At the start of your turn, you may exhaust a card. Huh. So 7 damage, fetch an attack from your draw pile. <sighs> Why do I want an exhaust card? That might be useful later, but at the moment, it does absolutely nothing for me. Uh, two on the left, two on the right. Uh, shop up there. It sounds like we're going this way. All right. Um. Yeah, but, meh. <sighs> mm hmm. 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 And. Fetching an attack doesn't do me any good, but I can make these stronger while I'm here. I'm kicking things under my desk. Uh, uh-huh. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So they still get powered up, but I can't do damage either. Didn't think of that. Um, is this technically... Curious. I'm a little surprised it worked, but, you know, I had to try. Um, meh, meh. Uh, I think I could just kill you, but I don't know. Just in case. Yeah, I could have just killed you. But it's okay. You have a lot of strength for a tiny thing, don't you? Okay. Draw a card. Increase its damage and block by two for the rest of combat. I really like that. I also like this. Cogs are zero cost cards. I really want enhance. Hmm. Um. Um, okay. What are you, what negative effect are you doing? Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Uh... I see. I see. This is a. Uh huh. I get you. A little, um, come see, come see. Yeah, fuck. I could have played that instead. And then got the treasure. I'm stupid. But it's okay. Uh, hints. Mmm. Nanama, Hmm, greedy little boy. Uh, okay. I really just need to kill you, honestly. This is getting dumb. Uh. Eh. Why did I play that in the in the whatever? Uh, 
getting considerably stronger, sir. A little concerned. I think I just need to kill you already. Eh. Uh oh. Hmm. This is a little concerning. Yeah, I think it's, uh... Hmm. I'll take one more damage. Boop, thank you! Durian, whenever you gain a debuff, gain temporary HP equal to the amount. At the start of your turn, reduce your turn-based debuffs to two. On pickup, increase your max HP by five. Hmm. Okay. Quantum Strike. Deal four damage. Start a combat split into two entangled copies. Entangled cards are treated as multiple instances of the same card. Effects that modify one will modify all. I want to get it just to see how that works, to be honest. I'm so confused. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh. Three entangled copies. Sure. Sounds great. Let's do it. I'm not going that way. I will die. I'm going to go that way. It's horrible. Why am I doing this? Oh my. Uh. Hmm. You guys do not attack in order. I am uh, a little concerned by this. Can we, like, not do that? I'm gonna die. I shouldn't have went this way. Jesus Christ. Um... You guys don't strike in any sort of normal, responsive manner. And I'm dead. Like, right now. No? I'm taking 15 damage. Okay. And I'm dead. Uh, I knew I shouldn't have went this way. Why did I go this way? Uh, yes, it's not quite the topic. <coughs> they've um they've updated the mod a bit since I played it. Uh, I'm just gonna pretend that didn't happen. And you know what? Actually, can I turn off mods from here? I really, really, really do not want to turn this mod on. Hmm. No, never mind. I don't. I don't want to mess with the meta f data. I. I can't. No. No metadata here. Uh, let's just go. Go in and pretend that, that never happened and try again. Because I, I was really stupid. Really stupid. Please tell me that this is not the same. Okay, it's not. <laughs> um. There's three really pretty fires over here, and I kind of want to follow them. Let's do it. I need sleep. Have one really powerful strike. That's how you win this. Um, hmm. Interesting. Okay. 
Uh, took damage. Everything is fine. <sighs> Boop. Okay. Roar. Roar yourself. Uh. Yeah, I'll take it. Let's, uh. Eh, whatever. Break through the shield. I really liked the quantum blade. So, that's interesting. Um, okay. Clone. Choose a card that isn't depleting, exhaustive, or fleeting. Add one entangled copy of it to your draw pile. Oh boy. Choose attack or skill. Choose one of three random cards that of that type to add to your hand. It costs zero this turn. Or an adaptive shield. I l really liked adaptive shield. I'm going to grab it again. See, it's just a great time to use it. So, thank you. Um... Five, four, five. Wait, the Tinker stuff stays upgraded? Oh my. Oh my. Oh no. <laughs> I've not understood the level of complication I've gotten myself into. Oh god. Okay. Uh, can I just kill you? No, I cannot. Alright. Alright. So I should constantly be doing that to up make my cards better whenever I get the chance. Good to know. Good to know. Hey, milkshake. Cog shield. Gain five block, shuffle a cog into your draw pile. Charging blade. Deal two damage every time this card is played. Increases damage by one for combat. This is basically just a uh, claw. Um, deal four damage. Upgrade a card in your hand for the rest of combat. Uh, rebound. First time you play this card, you just try and put it on top of your draw pile instead of your discard pile. I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Uh, can, I, can I? Thank you. The upgrade is what done, did it for me. Um. Mm, strawberry isn't really worth it. Like, I like my HP being up. Don't misunderstand me. But I don't think it's going to cause... The, the, the regret is too much for me. I can't deal with the regret. So I'm going to get max HP plus 5. Because I don't need the 2 extra. So, hello, little shot guy. Um, assembly line. At the start of each turn, shuffle a cog into your draw pile. Why is stuff so complicated? When you play a card this turn, gain a strength and one dexterity until the end of turn. Craft Vira. Gain one strength whenever you deplete this card. Acquire a Vira. Ooh. Hey, it's Quantum Strike. Hey. What happens if I upgrade you? That's what I want to know. Like, hold on a second. Ah, oh, makes you... Okay. Interesting. So... Four, four, and two. That's only ten. Oh, I'll take two damage, whatever. Oh, wait. This is five because it's, yeah, <coughs> it's entangled. Woohoo, learning things. Uh, I'm going to tinker adaptive shield because hell yes. And strike. And then upgrade my shield. Uh, ha. <sighs> T 
Tinker, a Quantum Strike, because constant permanent damage. Duh. Um, boop, because it affects all of you, not just one. And... Boop, and boop, and boop. Now you're going to die next turn. So that's pretty cool. Mm, could have crafted a Vira. Or I could have gotten a Vira to start crafting. Um, ooh. Hello, Wena. Uh, I'm going to grab this. Looks interesting. Let's move the card. Let's upgrade. Uh, let's upgrade this to cost less energy. It's fleeting, I'm aware, but I'm going to anger some mushrooms. Hello, mushrooms. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. Uh... Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take one damage. It's just one damage. Okay. Um. Nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna. Okay. Um. Should be using more shields, I know, I know. But, like, the stronger I get... Does this... work on you? No, it does not. I mean, I just have the 18 block. I might as well. Eh. Okay. Uh. Boop. And boop. One, one more for Vira. Do I have to do it in a combat? That's the question. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, uh this is gonna hurt now. Did not realize what I was getting into. Uh Hey, nice. Oh, I can still do this. Cool. Ah, <sighs> because it still increases the combat, and that's what's important. And boop, and boop, and boop, and I'll take two damage. Screw you. On mushroom. Ah, okay. Take ah, that's right. It makes me take less. Uh, permanently upgrade a card in your hand. Fatiguing three. Yeah. Okay. Uh, huh? uh, that's with the card. I don't see any reason to upgrade you. I kind of want to upgrade Condom Strike though. Or a uh, Dative Shield. Mm. Let's upgrade Tinker so I can upgrade my cards more during combat. That makes sense. Upon pickup, choose a card. When it is put in the discard pile, shuffle it into your draw pile. Oh boy. Uh. Hmm. 
I wonder if it works like that. My, meh, I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade you. I don't know if the yo-yo will work with you. It's a really interesting, oh no. This could be really good or really bad. Oh man. Why do you hate me? Prize? I have a prize? Oh, it does. The yo-yo works. Cool. Um, I don't have any shields. So let's do this. Um, okay. All right. I don't want to go with this. <sighs> Maybe not. All right, yo yo's. Uh, I can actually just kill you. Okay. Oh my. All right. System hardening. Whenever you draw a card this turn, gain two block. Deal four damage, add a cog to your hand, exhaust it three. Deal 16 damage whenever you play this card, reduce its cost by one for the rest of combat. So this is like the sister card of the, the other one. Innate ethereal. Every four turns, gain a buffer. Excusa? Uh, yeah. I gotta use the shield. I don't want to, but I got it. <sighs> I am learning things about this mod that I didn't know before. Uh, na, na, na. Ah, God. Ugh. Okay. You guys are quite finished. Um, I really need to figure out how to kill you faster. You guys scare me. Oh, I have a buffer. Good. Um, all right. All right. Uh, Oh, that was... 
scary. Please die. Please leave me alone. Um, let's do it for all of them or just one. I God. So happy to be able to sleep. Um, Three Thorns is amazing in this fight. Also, that's definitely good to have in this fight. And then we'll see about the energy. Okay. This is not a good start. Not a good start at all. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, well. Uh. I need this shield so bad. Uh, I'm gonna die. Oh, oh lovely. I really am gonna die. This is a goddamn yo-yo. I know I could be better at this mod. I'm just not right now. <laughs> and I'm more than sure you guys are going to tell me all the things I'm doing wrong. And that's okay, because I have to learn to get better. But I'm just not a very smart cookie. So I'm going to leave that episode there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode of whatever I decide to make. We're not setting out. Bye.